up you guys? Welcome to the channel. Quick shout out to the family of Dirt Monkey, our bro out in Minnesota. Today we're out here with Mike. We're on the job site. Eric's rehabbing his house and we're talking tools. We're going to talk client tools today because I was actually talking to Mike. I'm like, what kind of tools do you use? What hand tools do you use? And he said client. Now, before we start, client is a sponsor of the channel, but what Mike's about to say is completely his own words and that's it. So, Mike, how long have you been an electrician? I've been do I've I actually started with my father when I was like 12 years old. Wow, was, that's crazy. I was, I was I was just a gopher. That's yeah. what I was. And I learned how to start piping right away. And this was my first bender that my dad gave me when I was 14. Wow, is that a Klein? It's a Klein. Wow. And I'm 53 right now. So Holy I've been cow. using this bender for what, 39 years yeah. now? So, and this bender used to be on this other bender. This is a short radius bender. Lou makes this. And this bender used to be attached to a pipe and it was about this long, if you can imagine. And bending so much pipe, believe it or not, this heavy rigid pipe broke in half. Oh, wow. Before any of this, I, I, I wore out the pipe that was in between from bending. Right. But this used to be so smooth, you couldn't even grab it. Jeez. So, but I still got this bender. It means a lot to me. I'll never let it go, and it's a great bender. Yeah. You know, so I I really like it That's a lot. Cool. I think one of those things you'll put it when you're retired, just put it on your. Well, mantle, this is man. this. It, I, I I like to hold on. You know, I hold yeah. on to stuff. It reminds me of, of you know growing yeah. up working with my dad because I worked a lot with my dad. Exactly. So. And that's the thing, man. The trades aren't what they used to be, you guys. I mean, not a lot of people are getting the trades. Back in your day, getting the trades, you're proud. You're, you know. Yep. Now it's like all these kids just want to sit on computers all day. Yep. And it's hard to find yep. trades. Yep. And you guys. Be a tradesperson. Go to your local. Uh, what do you do to become an electrician? Go to your local. Well, I mean, you could do you could do a few things. You could try to go to the union and try to apply and, and, and get in, you know. Or you could get with a company like like ours. Right. And I started out a lot of guys in our company and um, knowing nothing. And I got three or four or five guys right now that own their own companies. Wow. And we still all talk. We still all, we're all good friends. We actually help each other out when one guy's busy and the other guy's not. Right. And we just you know we stay close. That's so awesome. So it was a great crew. Yeah, I mean, that's I had a, cool. I had a big crew at one time. It was yeah. A great crew. Yeah. So, but yeah. That's cool. And what other Klein tools do you? Use? Well, I got I got all my all my screwdrivers are Klein. I got a rough screwdriver because we do a lot of piping here. You know, that's all we do here right. around the Chicago area is pipe. Right. Now, is that just a Chicago thing because of code? Or? Could, well, the towns, you don't have to use pipe. It's adopted by the town to use pipe. Gotcha. Um, it's actually, I believe, it's the best way to go. Yeah, I do too. It protects it the wires. It. It's a good ground. You get that additional ground with the with the pipe. Right. You know? So I, it's the way I, I, I like to do piping. So I got my rough screwdriver. I got a trim screwdriver I keep on me. I got a medium-sized screwdriver, which I've had for a long, long time. It used to have a, a yellow protection on it, but I wore it off, but oh, wow. I, still, I still got it. Square drive, which is one of the best tools because my eyes are getting bad, and now the connectors are all square right. drive. So I, I don't have to look for the groove anymore. I can just slip it in right. and find it. In. Right. And, and, and the one thing I love about Klein tools is that it seems like all their screwdrivers, tips and stuff, they fit the fittings nice and tight. Like you could go get different tools, I don't want to name names, and right. you put them into the fitting and it and it slips around. Klein is just, it's made for it, it seems like it's like made for the screw that you're using, you know? I, that's what I love about it. Yeah. You know, so I, 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 got, I got all these and I actually keep a longer Phillips set on me. Um, now, quick question, you have all these screwdrivers, I know you need the demo screwdriver. But would you go with an all-in-one? No. Why? Because I've been using this like this for my whole life, right. and I'm used to a way. And I don't, I can't, I can't. I've tried to change and do right. stuff like that. I just, I'm just not used to it. Yeah. I just can't get used to it anymore. So I like to stick. Oops, I'm sorry. I like to stick. It broke. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just kidding. I, I, I like to stick to what I'm familiar with to make right. my job go quicker. Right. So, and then I got my my Klein oh, linesmen, yeah. which are great. Do you have any uh, chunks blown out of it? Every uh, every electrician I talk to has chunks blown a, out of it. There's a little. Yeah, uh, there is. It's a war wound right yeah, there. Yeah, all got war wounds for <laughs> live wire. It's a war wound, but it didn't it didn't actually chunk out the, the, 
cutter, so the cutter's still thread. And then I keep channel locks. Um, there are a lot of tools for cleaning pipes out because right. we cut the pipes. For reaming? For reaming. You have to clean up, you have to clean the pipes out so it doesn't wreck the wiring. Right. So this is the old way we used to do it back. And I, I you cut the ends off and you clean the pipe out and, you know. I saw one guy in there, he had that little adapter that goes yeah. on that yep. also reams and runs. Yeah. But the same thing with you, you're doing it I that just way, like, you like, I just, that's the way, that's the way I like doing it. That's you cool. know, I just, I'm used to it and it makes my, I just couldn't get used to doing that. So I just keep doing it the way I've been doing it. Right. It may not be as fast, but that's what makes me comfortable. Yeah, no, that's good, man. So, but otherwise, you know, besides all that, I always use a lot of Milwaukee tools too. Yeah. Yeah, Milwaukee's really pushing the market. So, yeah. you know, but, it's, uh, it's crazy. They're trying to they're trying to get in on buying. Yeah. Have you used any of their hand tools at all? Or? Uh, Milwaukee. Yeah. Uh, no, we just no. use all their obviously their the tapes and power the power tools. Yeah. 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 So, well, actually, but, Klein just came out with uh, a twenty volt lineup with. Actually, I don't know if that would be for him. Would Eric, they came out with the crimpers and stuff. You don't do like big crimping connections. I got crimpers. Yeah, he's got crimpers in the back. Oh, really? But they're, uh, it's actually, it's actually, I believe, a Greenlee tool oh. with a Makita battery. Yeah. And it's actually from a comment, it's a comment crimper. Oh, okay. I want that. It's Do you use that a lot? Yes, I used wow. it the other day. Okay. I use it all the time. It's yeah. actually made by DeWalt. We use DeWalt batteries. So. Really? Yeah, okay. that's right. Kind of but yeah, we got all that stuff, all that crimping stuff. Yeah. It's cool. A lot of it, I got it just a little bit on the truck, but a lot of it's back in the shop. Because yeah. it's bigger stuff. Right. And it's okay. Unless I know I need it, then I'll go grab it. Economy's doing good. You're staying busy? Oh, busy. Can't yeah. even keep up. I've been, I, I've been working six days a week. We've been working six days a week. It's great. Yeah, I love it. Not for me. I like to just work like two hours a week. But <laughs> that's my boss on the camera right there. He doesn't let me say I'm working. You guys, Mike. Thank you, brother. Yep. Appreciate it. Yep. This is Mike. This is Tools in Action. Smash that like button down there, and don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to go to Instagram and follow us, and comment below, you guys. What electrician tools do you guys use? Do you like Klein? Are you using Klein? Are you using Greenlee? Are you using Southwire? Whichever ones you're using, comment below. Let's get the conversation rolling. Tools in Action. Remember. For more exciting tool action, go to toolsinaction.com.